What's going on my crew? This is Jay and welcome to another episode of Jay Adventures in Minecraft. Some of you guys may be wondering, and Jay, what you up to? And I will tell you in this episode. So, I just got an email. I am extremely tired, which means this is going to be a great episode. I have been working around the clock until today. Tomorrow I've got off. Going to be awesome. Going to work on the Ethlin server, all sorts of cool stuff. Um, recently, I uh, had to move my bed up there because of evil things over here. But uh, let's take a look at the sheep farm and I uh, get a gauge on what's going on here. So as you guys can see, I've started to get things in motion over here, which is has been really important to me. Um, let me feed these sheep here. It's, it's one of these things, I know some of you guys are probably asking, Jay, what are you really going to do with all that wool? Like, honestly, in the end, all that wool really isn't going to do much for you. Um, it is. It really is. And I'm going to tell you why. So, when we are building things, and uh, when we get more advanced, we're going to want to build things like flags. We're going to want to put things in, like, carpet and all that stuff. And I don't want to be constrained to one or two colors, and I don't want to, like, pick something that's, you know, just one color. Ooh, hello. Oops. Um, I want to be able to be a wide, um, someone that can be of lots of variety and all that stuff, so... That's sort of what I'm shooting for in this instance. So, hold on. This is part of being tired, guys. I, I really, I really try to make videos for my friends, and now I fail at it sometimes. Ugh. Oh God, this is horrible. Oh, I've got a headache. Today was not not my, one of my best days. However, that's over. We've got tons and tons of stuff. I need to organize it. All part of what I'm going to do tomorrow. But let's take a good look at this view. Because I took a picture um, of where our stronghold is. So we know where that is. We also have a mine shaft that way. We've got so many things. And uh, so many opportunities we need to go through and do and all that stuff. But I want to let you guys know that uh, when I'm recording this, uh, it's going to go up the same day as, and this is if everything goes well, um, as the live stream. So probably in about two to three hours from hopefully when this video goes up, there will be a live stream. And basically what we're going to do is probably mess around on here for a little bit and then I'm going to actually head over to the Ethlin server and do some work on there. I had some something lined up that I wanted to do with you guys, but now I forget what exactly that was. Let's um let's have some fun. Let's go uh take a look around. I haven't been out that way, I don't think. So I want to I wanna jump over the mountain and see what's on the other side. And I think that'll be a good thing to do today. Because I want this, this episode to be a talky talk episode. Um, oh, hi. Just freaking toss me over the freaking side of the... Mm. Nope. And die. What was that? Is that a bow? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, first of all, I need to tell you guys about a dream that I meant to tell you yesterday. So, I had a dream that, basically, my leg was sprouting cratoceps. And what some of you may not know what those are. That is a um, zombie-like disease um, that takes over the brain of small insects like ants and grasshoppers and, and such. And basically what this bug does is it takes over their brain and makes them leave their colony or leave wherever they are and end up going um, close to, I think, a leaf or whatever where the Cridocep, uh grows a mushroom called Cridocep. 
out of the brain of the animal. I mean, insect, which I technically is an animal. Um, and I had a dream that these cryoceps, and, and I'm going to explain further what exactly it was, were coming out of my leg. And it was really gross. Um, but what ended up happening is I, I was like pushing out it out and it turned into a flower it was really weird but it was scary and I, I was thinking like how do I get rid of it because it's a flower and I can't just rip it out because that's gonna hurt and like I was scared I was genuinely scared so yes that's that's my dream and I'm terrified now of cryoceps and terrified that I'm going to get one growing out of my leg. But I'll get over it soon. Um, I wanted to thank a lot of you guys. And um, I, I, I feel like, once again, I need to like write a list down of those of you that are, are just so amazing. Um, and you guys are giving me so much support, telling me so many nice things. And I have to tell you guys... You guys say a lot of nice things about me, but here's the thing. Like, I I don't think you guys realize how much I'm grateful to have subscribers like you. Especially being such a small channel. You know, this this channel right here, this is when you get a lot of haters, you know. This is when you're supposed to be getting people saying, oh, your videos suck, no one wants to watch your videos, and all that stuff. And instead, I get people telling me things like, oh, Jay, you know, you should have a lot more views, and like all these all these awesome things. And, you know, I've got 250 subscribers, which honestly, when you really break it down, it usually means you're going to have like one person, one person that really watches your videos and comments and instead I've got a bunch of you that like comment and just give me a bunch of feedback and all this crazy stuff and it's like dear god like you know honestly if I don't grow another subscriber I'm fine with the way the channel is right now like I know a lot of you guys are like oh well you, you're gonna make it to a hundred thousand blah 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 part of me like, a little part of me right now is just saying, you know what? Screw 100,000 subscribers. We'll stay right here and just soak it all in. If that's a pine soul forest, I will be very happy. Oh, could it be? Let's check. Um, seriously, like, I, I've been just thinking about it you know but that's just not the way life works and you know if I really want to live out my full potential and dream on here on YouTube if I become successful at it I'm gonna need to definitely expand this channel I hear you the question is is it a spawner? Nope. It's just you, you jerk. Die. I hear another one. Oh, oh. Well, no, 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 no. Two glass bottles. I do not take kindly to witches. And on this side. Aha, I found you. You are hiding. You are hiding. I win. Okay. No, we're not caving today. We're walking and talking. Um. Anyways. So, yeah. I just, I really wanted to let you guys know that I'm, I'm super, super thankful for you guys. And, honestly, like I said, it, if for whatever reason I was to, like, never grow another subscriber ever again, I'd, I'd be fine with it. Um, but, I wanted to talk a little bit about something that 
um, I feel like is for some of you guys that maybe have smaller channels. And this is something where I'm just letting you guys, uh, giving you guys some advice. No one's done anything wrong. No one's said anything bad or anything like that. Um, just some some advice for your channels. Um, it is not a good idea to go to somebody's channel and tell them, would you check out my channel? So I've seen this in my comment section, and, and quite frankly, it's pretty much all over YouTube. Um, if you want someone to check out your channel, especially for me, the best way to do that is to message me and say, Hey, Jay, I uh, really like your stuff. Would you check out my channel? Or you don't really have to say, really, I really like your stuff. But, you know, you could say, could you please check out my channel and uh, let me know what you think. And I will check out your channel and let you know what you think. Now, I am very, very strict on what I subscribe to. When I subscribe to something, it means that I'm going to watch every video. And even then, sometimes I don't. And I'm not going to... I'm probably not going to subscribe to... Is that ice? No, it's not. It is a mountain. Oh, let's explore it. No harm. Um... So yeah, that that's not saying that if I don't subscribe to your stuff, I don't like it. I may like your content, but that doesn't mean that I'm going to subscribe. Especially if I do get bigger, you know, if I have 100,000 subscribers, I won't be subscribing to everybody. Um, and by that I mean, like, you know, if your content is like you do a Hunger Games series, like, I'm honestly not really interested in watching people do the hunker games it just doesn't interest me so i may like your content i may think you're funny for one episode but i may not want to watch the whole everyday series or every other day series or even just once a week series you know and i don't want to like lead you on and make you think oh well he's watching me and and not contribute just because i know what it's like to have contributing uh, subscribers and I, I don't want to be a non-contributing subscriber mm. vanilla coke um, so I I just wanted to let you guys know that but I just if nothing else I really really want to drive home to you guys do not ever 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 put anything about you know subscribe to my channel on somebody else's or saying like, hey, everybody, could you subscribe to me? That's not a good idea. And what ends up happening is YouTube actually flags it for spam if somebody else doesn't. And you end up looking silly is the best way I can describe it in the nicest way possible. So just food for thought. And... Um, I want you guys to be good subscribers, and I also want you guys to be educated on that sort of thing so you don't get made fun of by other people because some people won't be as nice as me, and they will come to your channel and be mean to you, and I don't want that to happen because I know all of you guys are really nice and really awesome, and um, you know this world is full of enough people that are insecure and it's also full of enough people that are really mean. And we don't need to chalk it full of more people. Because I also know what it's like to have people make fun of your channel and make fun of your things. And especially when you're small, it, it doesn't feel very good. Even when it's just some random person. So, you know, the best way um, to avoid getting hate is to uh, be a good youtube citizen so with that being said guys i i do have to kind of turn off the video here Ooh, hello all the good stuff happens when i turn off the video um i would i do need to turn off the video because i need to get to bed and i'm very tired and of course i'm gonna have to live stream tomorrow so big day lots of things to do um, to prepare for that and to get 
uh, stuff going for that. Uh, ooh, ho, 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 white horses, beautiful. Um, I'm excited. I'm excited for the channel. I'm excited for you guys. Um, for what's to come. Oh, big, 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 big news! I forgot to tell you guys. So we do have more time. Um, I got the new job, which means that basically, uh, starting. Hopefully, January, I will be able to do a consecutive live stream every Saturday. Every Saturday. It will probably be around 5.30 p.m. Whenever uh, dinner time ends for me. So, right after dinner time, I'll be heading upstairs to my room where my computer will be. And we'll be live streaming for a couple hours every Saturday um, and that way some of you guys that probably miss live streams or maybe just don't know that I live stream at all can go up there and uh, watch some live streaming um, also means that I will be able to give you guys consecutive all the time videos and get myself onto a schedule which also means more videos for the future so uh, we are running a marathon here it is not about the race and winning it's about the journey so keep that in mind and uh, we're gonna have fun along the way and uh, our goal right now is 500 subscribers um, but like I said it's a marathon and uh, we just need to work at it together as a group as a crew Miners and crafters. So, that's going to be it. I think that's all. One other quick thing about the 500 subscribers. I'm planning on doing something for that. I'm not sure what, and I don't know how quickly it's going to come up on us. So, it sort of depends on that. But, uh, I want to do something. And... I tried to do a contest, but then the person that won never contacted me, so I never gave out the item that I was going to give out. So I don't want to fall into that again, and the, the whole contest thing, just total bombshell. No one got anything right, and this person that won got like one question right, so I was like, alright, I guess I'll give it to them. Mm. Anyways, that's sort of an update for you guys. A little bit of an update video as we explore. So, that's going to be it. Once again, thank you guys so much for everything you guys do. Um, make sure to rate, comment, subscribe on this video. And until next time.